Was what is that thing? Oh, nothing. It's just the Omega weapon. The one from the blueprints Rain Henry got from all those bad guys in No Man's Land? Yes. The one that can take away Ray's superpower? The same. Why would you build that? Because Ray told me I couldn't, and I hate it when people tell me I can't do something. I thought he said you shouldn't build it. Yeah, well, he shouldn't pinch my cheeks and steal my cereal every morning, but I guess we all do things we shouldn't do. Not in this case. Man grenades? By Schwarz. Enter one, two, three, nine. Come on! Hey! How am I supposed to use the bathroom? Ah! Hurry up! I gotta pee! Get danger! Put that in here, go back on this, and aim it at Ray! Are you insane? Yeah, do it! Charlotte! What? Don't miss! What are you doing in my house? Your house? Yeah, yeah. Just play along. Pretend you're a burglar. Uh, okay, uh... I'm a burglar! <gasps> oh, yeah? Well, I have this weapon. No, yank it from me. Right. Oh, no! You yanked away my weapon! So now I'm defenseless! Now blast me! I just made this. It shoots backwards. Well, can you just explain that without making me blast myself in the face? I have completely overhauled the man cave computer network, and now I can activate this. What is it? Is it for sword practice? Well, technically anything can be used for sword practice. That's right. Put that cube on your head. No! No! no, 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 no. Just watch. Hello, I'm Hallie, the new man cave operating system. <laughs> so what does she do? What would you like me to do? Okay. She I know, right? right? <laughs> she can do anything. She's like a, a real person inside a computer. She can detect and eliminate threats before we even know they exist. Oh, uh, we already have somebody who can eliminate threats. He just got a sweet sword named Justice. <laughs> Schwaz, your dumb computer just lasered my sword. Yeah, because your sword was about to kill Jasper. <laughs> but Hallie saved him. Thanks, Hallie. Don't thank me. Thank Schwaz for creating me. He's a genius. Oh, I bet you say that to all your programmers. Only the cute ones. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want me to do, dude? There's a ton of party trash here. Just use Schwaz as a super sucker. Hmm? Just use Schwaz as a super sucker. What's that? It's a vacuum he modified that can clean up any mess in minutes. Oh, yeah? Yeah. He uses black hole technology to shrink objects down to the subatomic level, then just sucks them right in. Isn't that right, Schwaz? Uh, that's how a five-year-old would describe how it works, but yes. <laughs> he says I'm right. <laughs> any Ray, it shrinks and it sucks, and that's all you need to know. Sweet beans. Can you bring it to my house? Uh, no, I cannot. Um... May you bring it to my house? Will you bring it to my house? Please? Simon says, what's going on here? Schwaz also invented an electromagnetic delivery cannon that can send objects very quickly over long distances. Or very dangerously over short distances. We'll blast it to you. Blast it? Yeah! <laughs> okay, uh, 
Uh, is Charlotte there? Because she's normal and I'd like to talk to her. Sure, I'll put her on. <laughs> hey, Henry, it's me, Charlotte. How about those teachers at school, huh? Real minos. Ray, I know it's you. No way, it's your bestie, Charlotte. And I think you should just let Ray and Schwaz use the cannon and be thankful they're even giving you the super sucker. Fire from the hole! On its way, kid! Uh, hey, when's it gonna get here? Probably before I even finish this sentence. Comma? Which is technically still going on a comma. It's taking a little longer than I expected. <laughs> Goethe is an android. A fancy robot. She's... That's a machine? Show the kid. Uh, Goethe, Joklovich, Uchwaza Schnuggen Bushnavia. Goethe. thing I've ever seen. <laughs> you ain't seen nothing yet. Oh, really? What's she gonna pull off next? No, no. Gert is a shape-shifting android. Show him. Okay, shut up. That did not just happen. Did that just happen? Hi, my name's Delilah. Well, hey there, Delilah. I did it. You said it was impossible, but here it is. Schwaz, what are you doing? Drex told me I couldn't modify the memory viper to erase the whole town's memory all at once. But he was wrong. I did it. Schwaz, are you helping Drex? Oh, no, no, I just built this device to prove him wrong. And in doing so, I helped him. <laughs> so, yes. <laughs> smash, smash! Oh, can't let you smash this. I'm going to need it for my big plan. What big plan? Oh, I'll tell you. Sick villain monologue coming. See, what I want is to destroy what Captain Man loves the most. And what does Captain Man love the most? Churros. Water slides. <laughs> Henry's mom. No. The thing Captain Man loves the most is himself. That's right. Captain Man is obsessed with himself and with what other people think of him. So what if other people don't think of him? You're gonna erase Captain Man from the memory of every single person in Swellview. Very good, Kid Danger! <laughs> good luck with that plan. What do you mean? This thing won't even work unless you attach it to an airborne object like a plane or a helicopter. What a great idea. <laughs> Why? Stop helping him, dude! Oh, it's okay. You see, he'll never figure out how to mount it and calibrate it without me, and I'm never coming with you over my dead body. <laughs> hey, Henry. Hello, Henry. What'd I just say? You gotta come back with us to the man cave. No, I'm not going back. No matter what you guys say. Then they won't say anything. Hey. What up with the bean? Why, why? There, now you grab Henry and we take him back to the man cave. Oh, me? Schwaz, get back here! Wait, are you seeing? How's it going over there with the trap, Schwaz? I just need to attach more flashing lights. Is that really necessary? Not at all, but look how cool they are. It worked. Yeah, I caught him in a time loop. That's amazing. Now he's stuck reliving the same three seconds over and over and over and over and over and over. We get it. <laughs> Looks like he's dancing. Oh, oh yeah. He's doing a little dance thing. Look at this. Now I'm doing the dance. You see that? <laughs> we need your help. 
What you need? Well, we think we found a solution to our moth problem. We just need someone to be a guinea pig and test it out. Yeah, I need hundreds of moths to make a pheromone spray that is so powerful, it will attract every moth in Svelview to you and away from the trees. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You want to spray something on me that's going to make hundreds of moths swarm all over my body? No way. No problem. We respect that. Yeah, just bobby the ass. Yeah, you know, as a distraction. Hey, 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 hey. He's ready. For oh, what? Side and observe. Hey, go outside. Aim outside. Go outside. Go outside. Go outside. Go outside. It's not cool, guys. Oh, but you look at that. It works. <laughs> hey, Shar. You ever eat one of these things in this jar? No. You're on! I said no, I do not dare you to eat one. I can't believe you're daring me to eat one of these things. You are crazy. I'm not daring you! I'll do it, though! Jasper, don't! We don't even know what those things are. Here I go. You're sick, lady. <laughs> hey. I have to. Charlotte dared me to. Why would you do that, Charlotte? I didn't! I said we don't even know what those things are. Yes, we do. Those are eggs for a creature I invented. What kind of creature? Well, I took organic material left over from the alien space rock that crashed on Ray's head. This is a war that's way out where! And I combined it with DNA from an alligator, a honey badger, and a yank. Why would you do that? Charlotte dared me to. <gasps> no, I didn't! You're sick, Charlotte. So, what would have happened if he had eaten one of those alien eggs? Uh, I would have grown in Jesper's tummy, hatched, eaten its way out, and left him with a nice big hole right there. He yells when you draw on him. Wait, what happened with Drex? Oh, Henry brought him here. Drex is here? <laughs> is he, uh... He's totally fine. He just can't move. Or talk, or think, or kick, or punch, or pee. I hope. Well, how did you, uh... I used this. You blast the person with a beam from this, and it's like pressing pause on his brain. Yeah, but he's totally fine. He just can't do anything. Oh, like the Kardashians. 